So, <laughs> Mimo and Dirk trading subliminals and all that back and forth and everything. Mimo talking about he never got his chain took, you know, whatever, whatever, and everything like that. And then he slightway sent his subliminals towards Dirk. Dirk ain't, Dirk's too smart, bro. Dirk too smart. Dirk first response was like, I do the most for everybody. When it's my turn, I'll be sitting here looking stupid. Meaning what exactly that? Bro, I'm doing my thing. I got time to help you out. On top of that, Mimo don't play the patient game. When y'all see Mimo go back to his section, so to speak, bro wasn't rocking no OTF chain. I wonder why that is. I wonder why that is. He had the Steve Drive chain and try to talk about all that and everything like that. All right, cool. All right, that's cool. Prove what you want to prove. But nah. Then whoever dude is that you got around you, I'm not saying cuz name, is a goofy. He over here talking about we dealing pounds in the A. Are you the dumbest person? Bro, man, I'm telling you. And this is why they stop rocking with you. Because you hanging out with little dudes who don't know nothing about nothing. Discretion is at an all-time high if you can use it. But <laughs> I want to know, Mimo, why didn't you pull up to that shoot in Iraq yesterday? We know where that spot is. You you could have showed up. You could have made a call or something like that. You're not in. You, well, I believe you just left, so I ain't, I ain't finna do all that. But I could have sworn you still in Chicago. It's it's fifty fifty. I don't know. I'm not about to go and search cuz whereabouts or or nothing like that. But but Mimo, <laughs> you still ain't learning. Put your music out, do your thing and everything like that. That punk stuff for Shark on Land and everything like that. I'll make a separate video. It'll drop right after this one, like two hours afterwards. I know there's going to be some people who drop it. They're like, oh, man, they should be late. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. But Lil Durk and Mimo, they slide shots and everything like that. Subliminals. Because Mimo's video dropped damn near the same time that Lil Durk put what he put out. That's not coincidence. Because the timing didn't even make sense. When you study the algorithms, yeah, that timing made zero sense. But y'all let me know. Make sure you subscribe, turn on that bell to stay notified. And if you do me this solid, please do me a solid and leave a like. We need like 2,000 of those out here. Do y'all y'all think I'm tripping? Or is it kind of funny how Buddy went from Happy Father's Day, right? Because remember, he said, I'm off in a few all the way in May. It's all the way June. But miraculously, when he ain't tweeting about Father's Day or trying to promote his deluxe tour, he happened to sit up here and go at the same time that Mimo going. All right. Y'all act like these cats ain't watching like they ain't petty as hell. Dirk got the song we're featuring. You petty, yeah, I'm petty too. I ain't, I ain't trying to cuss because I ain't trying to get the video demonetized. But let's do it this way. Is it possible it's coincidence? Or y'all gonna think, man, Nash, you kicking up dust. I don't know. But y'all let me know. Because I know and I know for sure y'all wanna let me know y'all thoughts on this. For sure. I'll catch y'all on the next one. Y'all expect me to keep it real? Cause you know that I will. I do this daily, baby. Check out the Nightly Nash podcast. Also, Street of Music Setty Nash, if you have not. It's on all streaming platforms. Guaranteed you're gonna find something you like. Probably like that overly thugging freestyle. Or maybe something different let me know in the comments we possibly shoot that music video